books can entertain a reader in many ways. I think reading uh, cultivates imagination. I remember being a little girl and feeling like I had traveled the world because I was reading poetry and books and expanding my mind in that way. So yeah, we, you know, it's a cliche almost now to say knowledge is power, but it is. As we follow novel characters through the stories they tell us, we gain new perspective. We have windows where we get to see other people who are not like us and we get to experience different worlds, different perspectives of our world, and we really get to broaden our horizons by reading all these different stories. For the person who's reading a book that's not like their life, for them to see that there are other experiences happening in the world, and um, hopefully they'll grow from that. New York Times best-selling authors Renee Watson and Julie Murphy visited the South Irving Library to discuss Renee's new book, Some Places More Than Others. Which is a middle grade novel about a girl named Amara who goes on a daddy-daughter trip to New York City to find out where she comes from. It's about family and identity and um, celebrating your culture and your roots and forgiveness and learning how to love complicated people. While in conversation, Renee discussed the significance of writing characters like herself. I think the biggest inspiration comes from wanting to see girls who look like me in books and stories about girls who come from places like me, which is the Pacific Northwest as where I come from. I grew up in Portland, Oregon, so I write a lot about girls who are navigating uh, the intersections of race, class, and gender who are living in the Pacific Northwest. Seeing oneself represented in any medium is validating. Not having representation in books and movies and in music is like walking around and never seeing a mirror. Like never having anything say, this is who you are, this is, I see you, I'm here to, to show you yourself. Representation enables people to envision potentials for their own lives that may have seemed impossible. It takes a long time for us to realize that like the way we exhibit our bodies is how younger generations are gonna exhibit their bodies. Right, yeah. And so if we don't, if we don't show people that like, yeah, I've got a role my arm and it's fine you know it's gonna like create this sense in the younger generation of like when they look in the mirror are they gonna think the same yeah. things the uh, same awful things that we've thought about ourselves the discussion ended with an audience q a and book signing giving renee the opportunity to meet her fans i'm excited to talk with them tonight and see what they want to know more about and for readers to meet the face behind the book we want to show that these are real people who are creating and telling real stories for About Town, this is Susan Stevens.